It is a day skaters and local hockey players have looked forward to for a long time. Hello, I'm Alexandra Renslow. And I'm Shannon Slatten. On Thursday, contractors started the meticulous process of creating ice at the New Hope Ice Arena. It's a sign the long-awaited renovations are nearly complete. Many people don't realize what goes in the project of just putting in the ice itself. You wouldn't know it by looking. It's very intricate to get through the next five days. But it takes time and patience. It's a lot of, all right, let's get up and do it right. And then it's a lot of sit down and wait till it freezes. To pour the perfect sheet of ice. It's actually an art form. This summer's most anticipated sheet of ice is almost finished. When we renovate and have something new like this, uh, everybody's really excited. After 37 years of use, the New Hope Ice Arena needed work. Everything from refrigeration to the roof needed repairs. In March, work started. The old ice was hauled away, and for the first time since 1975, you could see what was underneath a dirt floor. The whole project is based on the premise that we're going to cut our utility costs, our refrigeration costs, by well over 33 percent. Cutting utility costs will ultimately help pay for the $4.2 million project, funded mostly by bonds and grants. We're going to save a lot of money by being on this ammonia-based system. Then the city invested $550,000 on giving public spaces like the lobby and meeting rooms a facelift. Those won't be finished until late August. But the crown jewel, the ice, will be finished up soon after a game of hurry up and wait. The floor was at 83 degrees when we started, and in less than 24 hours, uh, the floor was down to 19 degrees. Two layers of ice and two layers of paint later, it'll be finishing touches on a project that's supposed to last for another 40 years. We'll be ready to skate. If everything keeps running, we're going to be ready and open on time. And not a moment too soon, after the ice is open next week, there will be three consecutive weekends of youth hockey tournaments using both sheets of ice there. A big celebration with an open skate is planned for August 22nd, when all renovations will finally be complete.